We are finishing the Festival Orchestra Week this year with two works, and for both of them really, we are focusing on a connection to Italy. We are performing one of the great symphonic works dedicated to Italy, and we are performing the most Italian of all operas. The first half of the concert is one symphony, but boy is it one incredible symphony. This is the fourth symphony of Felix Mendelssohn. If you've been watching these casts, these video casts that we've been doing, you might have noticed that I mentioned that Mendelssohn gets great credit for bringing back to us the music of Johann Sebastian Bach. So we began our festival orchestra week on the prior Sunday with music of Bach. We end with the person who brought Bach back to life. And he was great at honoring lots of things. He honored Bach. He honored in one of his symphonies, Scotland. And in this, the fourth symphony, he wants to honor Italy. And that's why this work has the nickname, the Italian Symphony. This is some of the most famous music Mendelssohn ever wrote. As you listen to the third and especially the fourth movement, I think you will realize you've heard this music around you in popular culture all the time. It's great to hear this German composer, Mendelssohn, give you sort of his idea, maybe as a tourist, of what it feels like to visit Italy. For the second half of this concert and for the true finale of Orchestra Week, we have pulled out all the stops. We have assembled the greatest cast, our phenomenal festival chorus, the Phoenix Children's Chorus, our orchestra, stage director, and we're presenting for you a semi-staged version of Leon Cavallo's epic opera, I Pagliacci. I think most people know the name I Pagliacci and they immediately think of the opera. But if you are not sure that you know anything about this opera, I will just tell you to go to YouTube, type those words, you will come upon a tenor aria sung by all of the greatest tenors of really all time from Caruso to Pavarotti to Domingo, an aria called Vesti la Giuba. And this is the great theme that is probably the most famous theme in all of opera. So this is what we're going to perform for you. It's the story of a performing troupe, a troupe of clowns mostly, who travel around rural parts of Italy performing for villages. And there is a love triangle and there is a very serious plot twist and a very typical opera, deadly sad thing that happens in the story. To perform this, we have truly some of the greatest opera singers and those who perform these roles at places like the Metropolitan Opera. For example, Carl Tanner, our Canio, our Pagliaccio, our lead role, plays Canio at the Met. We're so excited to have Carl Tanner with us. For the other roles, for Nedda, his wife, we have Elizabeth Caballero, one of the finest sopranos singing anywhere in the country today. I got to hear her sing this role just last year. For Silvio, the great Russian baritone Alexei Lafrov, who is the rising star at the Met, singing multiple roles at the Metropolitan Opera all the time. Jonathan Blaylock plays Beppe. Jonathan Blaylock has been on the cover of numerous opera magazines in recent years. Great lead roles with major opera companies. And for the role of Tonio, a key lead role in this opera, we have Gordon Hawkins. I'm especially happy we have Gordon with us because Gordon has sung the lead role in operas around the world at the greatest of opera houses, and he is also living and residing and teaching now in our great state of Arizona. So it's wonderful to work with Gordon, one of our neighbors, and collaborate with him as well. E Pagliacci, it's really going to be a moment not to miss. An entire salute to Italy. Mendelssohn Italian Symphony, this work of Leon Cavallo, the final chance to hear the Festival Orchestra in 2017. See you there.